The Republic of Korea Army announced on May 27, 2024, the completion of the flight test for its 210th and final Ku-1 Surian utility helicopter. The flight took place at the Korea Aerospace Industries Kai, facility in Seichen, marking the end of a significant phase in the Army's modernization efforts. The Surian, with a maximum airspeed of 270 km per hour and the capacity to carry up to 13 individuals, has been tailored to meet various operational requirements. Developed between 2006 and 2012 at a cost of approximately $1 billion, the Surian was modeled after the SA-330 Puma and developed in collaboration with Airbus helicopters. Since its introduction in 2012, the Surian has been an integral part of the Republic of Korea's armed forces. This milestone marks the completion of the Surian fielding for the ROC Army, but various civil agencies, including the Korean National Police and the ROC Marine Corps, will continue to receive new aircraft. The Ku-1 Surian has enhanced the operational capabilities of South Korea's military with its advanced features and versatile design, underscoring the country's commitment to maintaining a robust and modern defense infrastructure. In March, it was reported that Iraq had demonstrated interest in acquiring the South Korean Ku-1 helicopter.